Welcome back. Today I got a flashlight I'd like to go over with you. I like getting some stuff off of Amazon and I thought I'd start sharing some of the stuff I get off of there with you. You get some really good deals on there with the uh, Prime shipping. You get the shipping in two days and if you want something quick that's a good way to do it. I've gotten this off of there and I've gotten a few other things off of there that I'll go through in other videos that I'll do. Now this flashlight is a Ulico and it is a pretty cool light now if you like going out walking at night like i do i live out in the country i like having a good flashlight with me because it's really dark out and this is the one i carry with me and there's a few reasons why i like this one on amazon right now with prime shipping you can get it for 13.99 that is not a bad price for a decent light now when i walk around at night and uh do some hunting and stuff at night it's always good to have a red or green light because it don't spook the animals. There's times that I go walking out at night and I'll see like a raccoon and I'll get this out, put it on that raccoon, just sit there and watch it. They're kind of neat to watch. So let me go ahead and show you the uh, beam on it. The beam on it is green. Now the cool thing about this one is it has a zoom. So you can move the head out like that and you can zoom in and out. I thought that was a pretty cool feature of it, so I had to buy it and try it out, and I end up really liking this. Okay, so let's go over some specs on it. It's got a 300 lumens Creed LED. It'll shine up to about 180 yards. It says you can use it in heavy rain, but do not submerge it, and I'll show you why I think that in a minute. It comes with an 18650 lithium battery. It only has a single mode. Now the thing I want to show you why I think it's not submersible, if we take it apart here and take the battery out, there is a rubber o-ring on this because this part zooms in and out. Uh, there's no way to put an o-ring on it to seal it off so I think that's why it's not submersible. Now one thing you can do with these batteries, you can get these batteries off of uh, Amazon too pretty cheap. This one I actually got at Walmart. There was a four pack of them on clearance for $6. So I picked those up. So I got about six of these now. I got about three different lights like this. I'll go over the other two in a different video. Now to give you some specs on this, the body is 30 millimeter. And it says the head diameter is 44.5. And it says that it weighs 4.4 ounces. Give me a second here and I'm going to leave the battery out because I think that's the way they weigh them. And we'll screw this back on and we'll grab my scale here real quick. And we'll wait and see what it says. Okay, so we got my scale out. So let's put it on there and see what it weighs. Get it so it don't roll off. It is saying five ounces, so it's a tad bit more than what they recommend. So that's everything I got for the inside. Now let's go take it outside and see what it looks like out in the dark. Okay, we are now outside with the Ulico flashlight. Let's see how it works. Bright enough to see my ugly mug, that's how good it works. Okay, let's give this thing a try out here. Now I'm going to shine this out in my backyard. This is how it is for when you're up close and you can see I do have some, I live out in the country so we do have outside cats, help keep the mice away. Now let's go ahead and zoom all the way out. Now right over there is my shooting range, I don't know how good you can see that. That's probably about, I'd say, a good 50 yards away. And actually, I think there might be a cat out there by my silhouette target because I keep seeing eyes. It could be that or some other kind of animal. And then to my tree line in the back, eh, that might be 100 or so yards away. And I'll shine it up in the trees. You can see that we can see out there pretty good. We can just play with the zoom here. Down over here. 
This is my kids' trampoline, and you can see the cats now in there playing. I'm going to see if I can get kind of far away and get it so their eyes glow a little bit better because that's the cool thing about these is seeing their eyes glow. Let's see if I can get that done here real quick. Actually, there's something out by the shooting range. I'm the adventurous night type, so let's go see if we can figure out what it is. I love walking around my property at night. You never know what you're gonna see out here. I got one of my cats trying to chase at my feet here. Now, hopefully this is a cat, not a raccoon or a possum out here, so let's go see. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's something back there with its eyes glowing. There's one of my cats. Let's go ahead. See if we can find out what's back here. I think that's so cool how their eyes glow. I got all of them coming out following me out here. But I really want to see what's glowing back here. Well, you know what they say, curiosity kills the cat. Well, let's see. Actually, I don't think it was a cat or any Oh, yep. There's one of the cats right in there. That's the eyes I kept seeing glow. Isn't that kind of cool? I saw its eyes from all the way back there with this light. Take a look around out here. Oop, I thought I saw something there. It could have been a lightning bug. But that far away, I could see that cat's eyes glowing from way back there. So to me, this is a really good light to have to carry on you. Well, that's all I got for today. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all on the next one.